Alright guys, Reckless here, and welcome back. Here we are with episode 2 of my Redstone Creation series. So today we're going to be building a different version of our Piston Trap Door. This one here is a little more advanced and it looks a little bit cooler. So what we're going to do is, first of all, we're just going to build up our frame here. Actually, no. You know what? We're just going to take a wood. What aren't we going to need in this episode? We aren't going to need pressure plates, so we can use our axe here. So, what we're going to do here is make it so that the pistons are coming from the bottom and from the top this time. So, we'll dig down on the bottom and throw down our two pistons and then throw down our wooden blocks. And then, when those push up, it'll be one higher like this. So then, the, so, then the next one needs to be to here. So, the wood needs to go to there. And then, hold on, I'm actually going to enable fly mode here just so I can do this. And that's not going to work out. So, if we actually just destroy this block wait no no that's still not going to work out so how can we get this aiming down here hold on uh no hmm we need to get this aiming down at the ground because this one here is going to push up to there so we need this one to push down to there so that means the wood's going to be there so we can destroy these two blocks and if oh i get it Watch this, and then we just go, no, there we go, perfect, there we go, so if you guys have trouble getting your piston pointing downwards, then that's how you do it right there, and we'll get our other piston pointing downwards at us here, there we go, and then put that there, alright, this is looking good, so these will come down to here, and then those will come up, so we'll just build our doorway around this here, and then just build these ones up, Alright, perfect. Now we can turn off fly mode for now. Alright, so how we're going to wire it is we'll, we'll use a button again for this one. So again with the back, go like this and throw down our redstone torch right there. And to wire this one, it's a bit more complicated as I told you guys at the start of the episode. So this is how we're going to do it. We need to wire it up to this piston here. So we're going to bring it down like this here and connect it to the redstone torch. So as you can see, perfect it's pushing downwards now we'll build this one out here like this and then go like this and then we'll do our little underground method again so we'll just dig this down here like this dig it across the back and then perfect just like that drag this down to here and again we're going to need to throw down a redstone repeater right here and then drag our signal across Perfect, just like that, and then we can cover it over here with some dirt. So we'll put it there, 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 and then extend our back out a bit more again. Just like that, perfect. Use up our wood, grab some more wooden planks, and then we'll just actually, yeah, we'll cover off the top like this. And I didn't mean to do that, <laughs> I need the auto switcher mod for this, anyways. <clears throat> So we'll just extend it out in the front as well, just so it's looking nice. Because you want to cover it up so you don't really see the pistons. So now when you push the buttons, these here are going to go up like that. And the reason one goes up after the other, this one goes up first and then this one goes up last, it's because of that redstone repeater we put in there, but you know, it's something you have to do. So now we're going to find the spot where we made these here. So we're going to notice that it's three blocks in. And if we go three blocks in, we have this in the way. So what we can do to get around this is dig it down here like this, and then dig under, bam. There's our piston right there. Then extend this redstone out like that. So now that one there is going to be pushing up like that. And then we'll do the same thing here. Drag it down, and then go underneath. And that block should have been destroyed. And then go like that. Perfect. If you guys are wondering why my world's so flat, I'm using the super flat seed. And actually, does, is that enough? Perfect. That's like just enough redstone. So if you do that the way I just did it there, then you will have exactly enough redstone to do this and do that there. So now if we press our button, they open. We walk through. They close behind us. So that's that there. That's That's a pretty simple one, honestly. But it is a little more advanced than the other one we did and it does look nicer like that so press that again 
Yeah, that's looking just right. So now what we're going to do is something that a lot of people find useful and uh, good to use. But we're not going to get into that in this episode. So I'm trying to think of something to do for you guys quickly. And, oh, you know what? I have an idea. So we'll do three high and then we'll drag it across here. And this time we're going to do a double iron door. And I've actually never done one of these, but I'm sure it won't take very long to figure out. So we'll just grab one iron door, throw that down, grab another one, throw that down, bring a button back here. Alright, so how we're going to do this one is we'll put our button right there. So, actually, wow, this one's quite simple too. So we'll just destroy this block here and close the door back up. Why the door open? I don't know. And destroy this block here and then just bring it out like that. And then if we just go like that, like you would have a regular doorway, a regular doorway for your house would look something like this. So all we have to do is put that there. And this time we don't have to use the redstone torch. So just put that down there. And for this one here, I've got to destroy this block right there. And then what am I doing? And perfect just like that now we're just going to do our little dig down method so we'll just oh all right we'll dig this one down and then go across here so dig this across just like that yeah that'll do just fine and then put that down there and then boom throw down a redstone repeater so that our signal will make it all the way across grab some more redstone here just like that and then cover it back up the way your house would look so build it just like this and then extend these walls back here like so and just grab some more wood here i'm not the best with minecraft nor am i the best with redstone but you know i understand it so i'm just trying to help you guys understand it a bit more so let's see how this works here so press the button huh, why is this door messed up all right we're actually going to have to destroy this door and then put it down again because for some reason it's acting strange and it went sideways like that. So we'll just mine away the door here which seems to be taking forever. Alright, you know what? Alright, never mind. I was going to say we'll just grab an iron or a pickaxe or something and destroy it. But it's, it is pretty much destroyed there. There. Two hours later the door is finally destroyed. Alright, so throw that down. Press the button. Hmm. Why isn't this working? Alright, let's see what's wrong here. Oh my. I see exactly what's wrong. Alright. Maybe if we... Well... No, because... This comes in behind like that. So this one comes in behind. But the door... Hmm. Hold on, guys. Bear with me here. I'm trying to figure this out. Why this will not work. Uh, we'll just grab a pickaxe here in case we have troubles with the door, which we seem to be having right now. So, we will grab the door here again, and, huh, I, I don't know why it's doing that. I'm trying to think of a solution. Maybe have... Oh no, because that's going to activate our redstone line. We don't want that. Uh, hmm. This is, yeah, see, this is the problem. I've never done a double door like this. If, if you want to have a messed up double door, you already seen what you need to see, but have that there like that. And this is still not working. Hmm. Don't know what is going uh, wrong here but and then all right I guess we just have a messed up door or something I don't know it's not I'm not used to redstone in 1.1 yet the redstone in 1.7 and stuff was a lot uh, it was a lot different than this so I'm kind of getting used to it as you can tell because yeah that was kind of a failure, but uh, this, this is the best I can do for you guys in this episode. Um, 
So, be sure to stay tuned for episode 3. I'm going to have something very interesting coming up for you guys in episode 3. And I think you guys will like it the best out of all these. And if I can, I'll try and find the solution to this double door so that I can get back to you guys on that one. Alright, this has been Reckless. I'll see you guys next time in episode 3. Talk to you later.